Is one side of my face bright and the other side dark? <sighs> I'm like obsessed with this top. Can I just like look at the bars? Hey everybody, welcome to another video. I am your host, Isabella Rule, and I will be not joined with anyone today because I'm lonely and lazy. Today's video is going to be a June favourites as I didn't do, did I do May? I don't know. There's not a lot in terms of makeup but the things that I have been liking have been like absolute staples for me this month. The makeup brushes that I've been extremely obsessed with. I'm the kind of person that goes through like obsessions and then just they die down after a while. I get sick of things pretty easily. These. <laughs> Real techniques and it comes in like a set hence why they're all the same colour. Literally just called fan brush, highlighter, Good, good, good setting brush, which I don't use for setting. I actually use this one for highlighter and on my like cheekbones and this one on my nose. And I use this, which is an angled sculpting brush, which should be used for contour. I use for my foundation because it's really good at like getting in all the nooks and crannies of your, your facial structure. Next thing, absolutely love the formulation and everything about this. It's the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. It looks like so. It is super dense and heavy. Quite pricey. I wouldn't say it was like extremely expensive, but it was definitely over my normal price range. However, I use this every single day. I always have like a sort of rule in my head whenever I buy stuff. If I feel like I'm going to get it down to dollar per time I wear it, and I've definitely used this more than 60 times. So last proper makeup item is the L'Oreal Paris Brow Artist Genius Kit. It comes with tweezers, a little thingy which I don't use, and this, and that's the main reason why I like it. And I don't know if you can tell, but it has a massive dip on the side because I use it every single day on my eyebrows and I love it a lot, a lot, a lot. And there's like the drugstore, the high end, and then there's like the in-between. So this is an in-between. The next thing is not a promo for my favorite YouTuber, but it is definitely something that I've been liking simply because the product is good. Zoella Beauty Wonder Hand Moisturizing Hand Cream, and it is massive compared to all the other hand creams I've ever bought. In proportion, this is the Body Shop uh, shea butter hand cream, which I've been using a lot as you can tell. Look at the size difference. It's huge. Just a really good hand cream. The next thing, which I just sprayed before, is the Victoria's Secret Fragrance Mist in Blush. I just, I've never bought any of these from Victoria's Secret, but I'll definitely be buying them again because I really, really like this one. It's really nice and my hands are doing really weird things today. Moving on. Okay, so the next thing is owned by literally everyone and their mum's cat. Massive Katmandu infamous down jacket and it's making me look really white because, you know, one, I'm already white and two, this is black. I love it so much. It's very good. I like it. The next thing I've been really liking in terms of clothes is these socks. They're like, I should probably tie them up. They're like all fluffy on the inside and they're just like the nicest sock in the world and they keep my feet very warm in the winter, which is lovely. I will move on to my favorite songs of the month. This month has definitely been a music listening month because I've been doing a lot of study. I've doing a lot of just procrastinating study, which is when I normally listen to music. It's by Imagine Dragons, and as most of you know, I love Imagine Dragons. It's Whatever It Takes by Imagine Dragons. Next song is by the one and only Shawn Mendes. Which Shawn, where are you at? Shawn, it's Ain't Nothing Holding Me Back, if you haven't heard it. The last one is by Niall Horan. Hold slow hands. Viral videos. Oh my gosh. Favorite, 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 favorite one is history of the entire world, I guess. And as a lot of people described it very well, like world history on drugs. Got 24 million views, 19 minutes, 25 though, so I won't be able to show you the whole thing. Britain just figured out how to turn steam into power, so now they can make many different types of machines and factories with machines in them, so they can make a lot of products real This month has been massive. Um, the first of June was the beginning of my uh, year 11 exams. So that was very intense. I did get my braces off in April, which is kind of sad that it is until now that you... No, in April? I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a massive thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I would really appreciate it. Um, 
that's all for today. Thank you everyone who has continued to support me and I will see you all in the next video. Goodbye, goodbye.